These ones on the right are big. That's what I'm looking for. That fish right there coming in, that's what I'm looking for right there. I just gotta get him to eat. Here he is, he's aggressive, he's aggressive. He's gonna smack it. Come on, come on. Fish on, got him. That's, that's the big one. There he is, there he is. Welcome back to another Minnesota ice fishing video. We're on a local lake today. We're fishing a super small bay of this really big lake. It's got a ton of crappie. I had a buddy come out here a few days ago. He's been catching 12 to 15 inch crappies. And I don't know what depth he's at, but I've got a live scope. And if you guys know what I do with my live scope, I send that thing down and I work the whole entire lake using live scope, drilling different holes until I find schools of crappie. I'm looking for those big marks on my graph that are huge schools of crappie. And then I just set up, sit on top of them and start catching fish. I'm gonna start out by working a few holes, dropping down my live scope and trying to find fish. Once we find the fish, we're gonna set up on top of them and we're gonna catch some fish today. It's about 7.30 in the morning. We got till about 10.30 to fish. Hope you guys enjoy this video. As always, stay tuned for some tips and tricks throughout the video. New ice fishing videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 11. Let's get fishing, guys. This is over a foot of ice. That is some thick ice. All right, let's see if we can find a school real quick. Oh, dude. Oh, yeah. Look at them all. That's a school right there. We're gonna go 40 feet that direction, set up right there on that school. Let's see. We're definitely on fish. I mean, this is a nice school of fish right here. Drop down to them. If we get one to hit, we're setting up on them. Yep, there we go. There we go. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. They're all coming at it at once. Fish on. Just like that. I gotta tighten up that drag. Boom. First fish of the day. Just found the school, huge school of fish down there. We're gonna set up on them and we're gonna catch the rest. All right, let's get inside. We are starting out today with the Acme Rattlemaster. The color is Glow Bloody Bug and it is a 1 8 ounce spoon. We're gonna drop her down here. I got it tipped with a little crappy minnow. I'm gonna try to jig some more of these guys off the bottom. As you guys can see, there is quite the high amount of fish down here. So we're gonna see if they, uh, they're really active for a little bit bigger spoon, otherwise I can size down, switch up baits and see what these fish wanna eat. I got a few fish coming up right now, we're gonna see if they're gonna eat. Bring it up a little farther, get them to chase. I mean, it's a good sign, as soon as I drop down, I'm having fish come up and try to eat. Let's see if one of them actually attacks it. Mm, look at this guy. He's coming in, okay, I like it. It's a good looking mark too. I'm hoping there's, these are like the bigger crappie. They're not with the schools, they're kind of solo. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. Oh, yeah. might eat the crappie. oh, that's a good fish. Look at that. That's a big fish right there. He's coming in, he's coming in. Here we go, here we go, he's gonna smack it. He's gonna smack it. Come on, eat it, eat it. Come on, that's a big fish. No. Oh, that's a big fish, whatever that was. This guy might eat it. Let's see. Fish on. There we go. Slab. Oh, look at that. Look at that, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Big fish there. Awesome. Good looking marks. I think we found the big crappie school. They weren't here, all of a sudden they're just here. I'm not liking all these fish going up to it. I'm looking for more of the solos. Not really a school of big fish, just a lot of them. Like that guy right there. Like that guy right there. That one under me is a nice fish. He's coming up to it, he's coming up to it. Another one, another one. Back to back right there. 
Oh, dude. Oh, dude. That's a nice fish. This is a nice fish. Oh my god. <laughs> the slabs. The slabs. Oh, oh my god. god. I found them. I found the slabs. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys. All right, I'm gonna keep these guys, these bigger ones to eat, but oh my gosh, guys. We found the slabs. That's like a 13, 14 inch crappie. This is a beautiful crappie right here. Absolute slab of a crappie. We did it. Used live scope, searched around a little bit, set up on a school of what looked like big fish. We started out with a slab right there. That is two big fish. Awesome. We're gonna keep fishing, catch some more big ones. Let's drop down to him here. This is a nice fish. This is a crappie. This is, this is a trophy. I mean, I'm on a school crappie, so this is a crappie. Oh, uh, we got this other guy coming in. Oh, man. Look at this guy coming in. This guy's running from the left here. He's not what I'm after, though. I want that bigger fish. These ones on the right are big. That's what I'm looking for. That fish right there coming in, that's what I'm looking for right there. I just got to get him to eat. Here he is. He's aggressive. He's aggressive. He's going to smack it. Come on, come on, come on. Fish on, got him. That's, that's the big one. There he is, there he is. Okay, that was a bass. All right, I thought, thought this was the big crappie I was after. They are just bass. I'll take it, I will take it. Nothing wrong with that at all. <sighs> thought these were big crappie. I mean, big fight, I mean, I thought it was just about to pull up a massive crappie. I'll take it though. Not exactly what I'm after, but Fish is a fish, and it is fun to catch. I am not even disappointed. It's a fun bycatch right here. I have not caught a lot of bass through the ice, but they're fun. I mean, look at this guy. Beautiful, beautiful bass. Thought she was a big crappie, but we'll take what we can get sometimes, guys. We will take what we can get. I'm just glad they're eating. We're gonna drop back down. But we are gonna catch ourselves a few more fish. I was kind of hoping those were big crappie, but you know what? We can't win them all, and that is perfectly fine. We're going to throw on another bait here. Oh, we're going to catch some more fish. Look at that. We got another big fish down there. Another big fish. Yeah, definitely aggressive bass. Any aggressive fish is a fun fish to catch. I thought they were big crappie. I really hoped they were big crappie, but that is perfectly fine. Maybe the rest are crappie. That was just a, a bass that came through. Who knows? Who knows? We got them to eat though. I'm very happy with that. So we're gonna keep on fishing here. All right, let's uh, drill some more holes here. All right, so s bad news. What? The fish aren't crappie, they're bass. I just caught them. What? Yeah, like two pound bass. Me I know, dude, I was hoping a big crap. Move that real quick, we're gonna move this guy. All right, let's drop down again. Look at that guy right there. He's gonna smack it, he's gonna smack. Got him. Got him. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. Good fish, good fish. Oh, come on. It's another bass. What am I gonna do to get on some big crappie around here? I was hoping that was a slab crappie, but I'll take it. I'll take it, another bass. Another bass here, guys. Not as big as the last one, but I'm not targeting bass. I'd love to get on some crappie. They are fun to catch though. They give me a good fight and I'll take what I can get sometimes. Fun to catch these guys. She's going right back in the water. And boom, there she goes. Now hopefully we can catch some crappie now. And I was just hoping that was an aggressive crappie. Really hoping that was an aggressive crappie. Here we go, here we go. Look at all those crappie coming up right now. Big school of them, big fish to our right too. I want that fish right there, that one coming in. Look at that. It's gotta be a bass. I mean, it's super long, but it's still a good mark. Oh, this guy's coming in hot. He's gonna smack it. Look at how fast he's going. I'm gonna let it sit. Got him. There we go. Came in and choked it. It's another bass. <laughs> of course it is. Turned into a bass day today. Came here to chase crappie, and that is bass number three. I mean, they're not bad at all. They're fun to catch through the ice. I've just really never targeted bass through the ice. I'm really getting these guys by accident while I'm trying to get on some big crappie, but you know what? 
They're fun to catch, they give me a good fight, and they're aggressive. There's nothing wrong with that. I got no problem catching these guys. This might have to be a crappy and bass type of video. I mean, yeah, I mean, I got no problem catching bass, though. Yeah. They're fun, they give me a fight. Exactly. There's something I can, like, actually kind of target right now, because throwing some bigger fat heads down, I can actually have a higher chance at getting them. My guess is they're sitting maybe 22, 23 feet of water. So, I drilled a few holes earlier today. What I'm thinking is, why don't I go take my, uh, my live scope and go sit in some of the holes that I just drilled and try to catch some crappie. I got a fish down here, though. I'm going to see if he wants to eat. But why don't I go chase after some crappie? Maybe get outside, get after him a little bit. Oh, as long as those holes aren't refrozen, I don't think they'd be that badly. If the fish aren't going to come to you, you got to come to the fish. I'm going to go see about maybe chasing after a few fish here. All right. 19 feet of water, a little deeper. Let's see if any of these guys are going to smack it right away. Oh yeah, oh yeah. They're on it, they're on it. Come on, smack it. Aggressive crappie, they are definitely moving deep after the morning here. Fish on. During the morning they're shallower, comes around a little bit later and they're pushing deep. I mean, look at these schools of fish here, sitting in the deep water. Used, uh, used forward view to find a school, sat about 50, 60 feet away from my tent and, and there is a lot of fish out here today, guys. Look at that guy, beautiful, beautiful fish. She's gonna go right back in the water. They move deep during the day, so all these schools are just gonna be filled with crappie, which is awesome, I got no problem with that. Let's keep fishing. Let's drop back down, see if we can get another one out of this hole here. Big mark to our right there. Oh yeah, it's windy. Here we go, fish on me, fish on me. Oh, just missed them. As soon as I dropped down, I got smacked. Here we go, he's coming back, he's coming back. He's on me, he's on me. Fish on. Right away. Another fish. Feels a little bigger than that last one. Yeah, a little bigger, that's for sure. Not in the slab like the first few were, but nice fish nonetheless. Found the school of fish. Once you find the school of fish, it is over. You're gonna be catching fish. Look at that guy. Aggressive fish, I mean, it is cold out here. It is about, I think, four or five degrees, but the fish are biting and that's all that matters to me. That is all that matters. Super, super windy. I don't got a problem with the cold as long as it's not windy. We're gonna get this guy back in the water. All I'm doing, throwing down my live scope. I'm looking for those marks and I want those aggressive ones. Crappie are notorious for being suspended. And if I'm tr what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get that highest suspended fish because usually that's the most aggressive one. I'm looking for a little bit bigger marks on the graph. I'm dropping down to them. Once I get close to these fish, I keep pulling it up higher and higher. They're usually pretty aggressive. So if you keep pulling them up higher and higher, you're moving them away. You're getting them to get out of their comfort zone. And usually they will bite if you do that. I'm happy with today. We've only been out here for probably about an hour, hour and a half. It's cold, it's fun, we're having a blast, and we're catching fish. I mean, what's better than catching fish? The bite stopped inside, so we had to get outside. And within the first five, what, five or 10 minutes, we've already caught two fish here. If this hole doesn't produce for a third fish, we're gonna go move around and uh, drill a few more holes and catch a few more fish, because usually you catch maybe two or three out of the same school, then you gotta move. Then you gotta go fish a different school. And what I know about this bay that I'm fishing in is there are hundreds of schools of crappie but only about three or four of them have the big crappie, and we got on that school of big crappie over there. We're gonna keep fishing though, see if we can catch anything else, and keep moving down. There's probably about half an acre of water here to fish, so I don't have too much time left to fish. I got some stuff going on later tonight, but give it maybe 30 minutes to an hour more, see how many we can catch, and maybe head back inside and chase after some bigger crappie at that other school. Let's keep going, guys. Yeah, we can head in soon. I got some stuff to do anyway. I'll try to catch, let's get one more fish. One more guy here. Shouldn't really take me too long. Yeah, school of fish where I'm on right now. I've been just moving school to school. Stick here, I shouldn't have a problem catching another fish here. It's getting pretty windy too. My camera's not liking that, so. We spent the morning out here, we caught fish, nothing wrong with that. Here we go, here we go. Aggressive fish coming in right now. I'm gonna let dead sick, he's gonna smack it. Come on, grab it. Oh, 
pulled it right out of his mouth. Felt him there for a second too. Here we go, he's coming back, he's coming back. Oh man. It is a windy one. on me right now. Let's smack it, buddy. Let's get one last fish. That's all we need right now. Last fish. He just needs to eat it. Come on. Come on. Got one coming in from the left here. We'll see how aggressive he is. A few fish, actually. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Fish on. Fish on. Got him to come right up. Just feels like a little guy. Yeah, it's just a baby. Not my ideal size I'm looking for, but we've gotten a lot today, so I'll take what we can get sometimes. Just a little crappie. Not the ideal size, but that's gonna be the ender for today. That was uh, three fish out of that hole in maybe 15 minutes. She's gonna go right back in the water where she belongs. And we're gonna end the video there. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will, uh, I'm going to be filming some more walleye later this week. So hope you guys did enjoy. As always, subscribe if you guys are new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.